So about almost a month ago, I made a video called um, Weird and Obscure Piggy Merchandise. Well, I'm doing it again because I have some more merchandise I want to show off that's pretty rare and obscure. So yeah, let's get into it. It's not going to be as crazy as last time, but I'm still going to be showing some stuff off. What I want to talk about is the Light Up Zombie Piggy plushie. Now, I see this a lot online, but there's no real videos on it. There's one that I know of by It's Lightning, which um, I did take a screenshot of one of his videos for earlier, for, for later on, because uh, I'll talk about that more later, but I want to shout out um, It's Lightning, because I, I borrowed a part from, of his video just so I can take a screenshot. And then Mr. Springs, I also want to shout out, because the Obscure Piggy video came from him. Like, this is why I'm making this video, because I thought it'd be fun to make one about Piggy. He does one on FNAF. I was, so I took the idea, but I will credit them both, because it's inspiration, and I kind of took It's Lightning's, part, like, a screenshot from his video, because I needed it. But yeah, so I don't see many images of Light Up Zombie Piggy anywhere. Um, but I see her a lot on Amazon, so she's not rare or anything. But there are just no videos for some reason. Seemingly no one bought her, which I guess that's why they only made one light up piggy plush. But it was pretty much the only way you could get a zombie piggy plush, though, because the other zombie piggy plush came in the zombie piggy head bundle. No, that's false. The piggy head bundle. And I'm pretty sure they're both the same price. So, would you rather buy? The light up zombie piggy or the tiny zombie piggy because tiny the zombie piggy and the um piggy hype bundle is tiny, tiny, tiny. But yeah, there's that one. That one to the next one, next, which is more plushies. Next, we have the jumbo plushies. Once again, they only made one wave of these and it came out during series two, but they're using the wave one designs. Um. Piggy, Taggery, and Clowny. They never made more of these, which is kind of sad, because these look cool. I don't own any of these, but there are some on the website still. Piggy has been completely sold out, but they still have some Clownies and Taggeries, which I think I would buy Taggery, to be honest. I like him the, the most out of all these characters. But yeah, these are really cool. They also came with this. Their own little bag, which is so cute. Like, I want that bag. In my collection, random to say, but I want I want a taggery bag in my collection. And there's bags for each characters. Piggy gets a bag, Clowny gets a bag, Taggery gets a bag. I'm not gonna show them all though, because it's basically the same thing. Just it's either the color of the character, it's it's the color of the character, and then they put their face on it and their name. So you can get a good idea good idea of what they look like. But I just wanted to show off the taggery one because I liked it the most. But yeah, these are cool. Um, I mean, I guess, I mean, the price, to be honest, is they're $20, which, the, which, the heads are more, but these are, honestly, a little bit cooler, cooler, cooler than the heads, because the heads are kind of useless, there's no point in buying the heads nowadays, especially the Frost Higgy one, that's trash, so, use your $40 to buy two of these. You won't regret it. They're adorable. I guess they're fun to hug. Now, I don't think they come with any DLC codes, which makes sense. But, yeah, I recommend buying these. These are adorable. I, I think I might buy one myself now. And maybe I'll show it off on a video. And see how big they are compared to a normal plushie. I don't know. I'm, I'm really thinking about it, though. Now, you might be looking at these and being like, Everyone knows what these are. These are the Piggy figure and Mini Toon figure. Wrong. These are the Toy Mini brand versions, which are in Series 3, I think. You can find Piggy and Mini Toon, which is just really cool. Um, I saw, I have seen some videos. They're not, the videos aren't called, like, Piggy Toy Mini Brands. I, I'm the only person who made a video called Piggy Toy Mini Brands Exist. Most of the videos are just, like, People who don't know anything about the game. Like, I saw one video. They called Piggy an anime. I mean, that would be cool, but... No. 
But yeah, these, I want these so bad. Um, they're seemingly, they don't seem too rare. Every video I've seen on Toy Mini Brands, they've at least gotten a couple piggies and Mini Toons, so. I'm definitely gonna be buying these soon when I see these in store. And if I don't get Peggy or Mini Toon, I'm gonna jump off my balcony. Totally. I, if, if, if I get a thousand subscribers by the end of the year, I will jump off my balcony, not clickbait. So here's the item that I took a screenshot from, um, wait, this is the wrong one. This one's a better one to look at. This is, um, the screenshot I took from It's Lightning video. It's, It's Lightning's video. It's the lab building set, which, looking back at this now, I'm kind of sad. This is a rare item at this point. No one can find it. No one really owns it. The thing was, I saw it in Target once. Multiple. But I didn't buy it. Because I didn't have money on me. And that was the worst mistake of my life. I wish I bought it. I wish I got it. Because now I can't find this anywhere. Look at this. This is cool. I like it more than the carnival, to be honest. Because, yes, all the figures are duplicates. But I'm fine with it. The build is what I like. They have the crates. Um, I'm assuming those are stickers, right? I don't know. I'm, I'm guessing. Um, we also have this, which is supposed to be a battery, which I love how they did this. They have it, so over here would be where you get the little valve in... Okay. They, they, they did this wrong. Orange room in the game is where you... They did this wrong. Fat Mojo doing something wrong? Whoa! So, in the main game, this room, well, where this bench is, the wall is supposed to be orange. It's green. The wall here is supposed to be green. It's orange. So, they didn't really get these right. Um... I, I don't know, how do you mess that up? It's like, they they should have me um, making these sets, because I know more about the game than Fat Mojo does. Now, yes, you could always just swap it out, but that's not what the instructions say. Anyway, this is cool. Now, it does have Piggy on the top for some reason. What is she doing there? Like, like actually, I'm serious, what is she doing there? But yeah, this is cool. I like this. A lot of space for the figures to stand on, which I like. Um, it's not really too cluttered. Um, I mean, the top part is, but the bottom part, you can put some good figures here. If you want to display all your figures here. I also mentioned, as seen on Chapter 12, Book 1. And there's also another thing. It's called Piggy's Buildable Lab. For one, Piggy doesn't own a lab, and two, this isn't the lab, it's the power plant. The lab doesn't arrive until 12 chapters after this one. So, I don't know what you're talking about, Fat Mojo, but do we ever know what you're talking about? Now, I'm not sure if there's a code for it. Like, I don't know if a code is in this. And if a code actually works in the game. That I don't know. We might never know. Because this is seemingly rare. It's not on. It, it, there's no images on Google anywhere. Which makes me more sad. I don't even think there's an eBay listing. I don't know. But I think that's pretty much all I want to show. Unless I can find more right before I end this. Can't remember if I showed this off last time. But there is a GameStop exclusive. Piggy wearing a black dress and white eye. That's it. That's all it is. I own it. I don't own normal Piggy, but I own this one. I don't know why I don't own Classic Piggy, but instead I got this one. Which, it's seemingly sold out. It's, I don't I haven't seen it on the GameStop website for a while. But yeah, I don't know why I own this one. Instead of the normal one. Will I ever get the normal one? Hopefully. And there's a lot of plushies I'm missing. I'm missing... Half the, like, most of them. I have two out of the how many they made. Oh, yeah, one more thing. So, 
once again using its, its lightning's video, and this exists. It's a yellow dino piggy. Why does it exist? I don't know. How do you get it? It's a rare, super rare chance you'll find it in one of the piggy head bundles. There's also a clowny you can find as well. Now, I don't know why they did this. Like, why didn't you make just a dino piggy head bundle? Throw it in there. Same with the clowny. Why don't you just make head bundles of the two and throw them in there? What is the point of this? Like, imagine you're trying to get Zom Piggy because you love Zom Piggy, which why would you? And you get Yellow Dino Piggy. You're not going to want to live anymore. You're probably going to want to get hit in the head with Piggy's baseball bat. Why? Why? Just why? And I don't even know how expensive these are. Um, I saw an eBay listing called like rare clown wait roblox piggy clowny jelly bean pink probably rare and that was literally the name of the listing people don't even know if it's rare or not so if you find someone who doesn't know if it's rare or not buy it because they won't know what they're missing out on they could be missing a lot of money and they wouldn't know it so if you see one of these for a low price buy it immediately I, I guess make sure it has all the accessories besides that buy it immediately because it could be pretty valuable and pretty hard to get I need to look for some of these I need these anyway that's all I have to do that's all I have that's all I have for today I recorded five videos today six videos today and I just cannot be recording anymore. This, that's that. That's more obscure piggy merchandise. I'll probably not make a part three because there's pretty much no reason to. Piggy merchandise pretty much over. So yeah, this was fun.